Hey, man. <laughs> I see you got some seaweed on your tail. Where? What? Oh, you know I'm just playing with you. <laughs> man, you all, oh, I thought you were talking about the other seaweed. <laughs> <laughs> you know I got jokes. <laughs> I'm going to slap you in my fin. Man, I never would have thought Quagmire'd get married. Nah, nah, I know Quagmire, and I'm telling you, this has got to be some kind of prank. You know, like that prank I pulled on Ashton Kutcher. Ashton, come here. <laughs> eh, you've just been tomahawked. That's my show. Tomahawked. So, how's the weaning going? No, oh, it's horrible. Giving up breast milk is the hardest thing I've ever had to do. I'll bet the Founding Fathers had an easier time writing the Bill of Rights. All right, we're done. You think the language in the Second Amendment is clear enough? You know, about the right to bear arms? Of course it's clear. Every American has the right to hang a pair of bear arms on their wall. How could that possibly be misconstrued? All right, fantastic then. Wait, you know what? Before we send this to the printer, let's take that abortion thing out. Boy, I never thought we'd be going to Quagmire's for an engagement party. I'm telling you guys, he's putting us on. He's the same old Quagmire. Hey there, neighbors. Are you lost? <laughs> I'm just Josh, and of course we're expecting you. Come on in, friends. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. If you all just uh, take your shoes off there, Joan and I kind of do the Japanese thing. Uh-oh. Foot odor. I have to go. I have, uh... Terrible foot odor. Glenn, your place looks wonderful. I feel like I can touch things in here now. We brought you guys a bottle of wine. Ooh, matrache. I like our friends. So Joan and I just love without a trace, don't we, honey? Yeah, it's all right. We think it's all right. What are you talking about? You hate CBS. Ooh, uh, hate is a word we don't use in this house. Joan and I always say, if you don't have anything nice to say about someone, don't say anything at all. <laughs> we say that, right, honey? Sometimes. Sometimes we say that. Hey, Quagmire, check out this month's Hustler, huh? Quagmire? Oh, now, this is neat. These people have put an old-fashioned colonial spinning wheel in the center of their living room. As furniture. Oh, that's what I want in my house. All right, Quagmire, time for your lap dance. No, guys, I can't do that. It's degrading to women. Come on, Quagmire, it's got to be you. I'm married, Cleveland's got foot odor, and Joe's dead from the waist down. Oh! Why do you bring me here? Ah, oh, Brian, my breasts are so sore, and they've gotten so engorged from the weaning, I've gone up two bra sizes. What? What did you do with the old bras? Okay, got to time this just right. One, two, three! Oh! Help! Somebody get this baby off me! Stewie! 